This video is part of the course that is build reports with Jasper Reports, Java and Spring Boot. Link for this course is given in the description. Hello and welcome back. As you know that in this course you are going to learn Jasper report and creating Jasper reports with Java application. So before we go ahead, let's see what is reporting and why we need it. So basically reports are representing the data. It can be in any format like tabular data or text data or maybe you are putting some images. Say for example, you are sales manager or maybe you are involved in the marketing team. Okay. And you are going for a meeting. So obviously you will prepare for it. So what will happen? You will bring the summary of the data. So that is report and it can be format of PDF or Excel file. Reports can have charts like bar chart and pie chart, say for example, to represent the sales data. So that also can be involved in the reports. Some examples, as I said, sales report, another one is report card of the student. Say for example, you are preparing the report card or say the mark sheet for the students. Now this you can do with Microsoft Office as well. You just have one template but you need to fill the data manually for each and every student. Say for example, there are thousands of students, so creating it manually will be difficult. So there comes the reporting with programming language. So here I will reference the reporting and creating the template with Jasper report. There are other tools as well, but this course covers reporting that is Jasper reports with Java. So what happens? You create one template file with Jasper reports. Now you have the student details in your database, say for example, MySQL database, okay? Student name, what are the subjects that the student is learning? You put that data in the tabular format that is inside your template file using the Jasper report. So what happens? You read the data from your Java application. It can be anyone, okay? A desktop application or maybe web application, Spring Boot application, it can be any. You can use Jasper reports with any of your Java application. So you read the data from your Java application and you fill the data in your template file that you have using Jasper reports. So what happens, say for example, you have thousands of students and you want to create the report card for all the students, then that will be just one click away. That's it. No manual task. You have one template file with Jasper reports. You read the data and fill the data from your Java application. That's it it will generate reports for you. So this is an overview of reporting and why we need it. If you like the video, then please subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, like the video, do comment in the comment section and share with your friends. Do you want to create reports from your Java and Spring Boot application? If yes, then I'm having complete course that is build reports with Jasper reports, Java and Spring Boot. Let me show you the report that you will be able to create after completing this course. So this is basically student report card and this is the report in the format of PDF. So in this course, you will learn how to have image in your report and how to have this kind of label in the report and text field. This value will come from your Java and Spring Boot application. You will learn how to have data in the table format and how to make some of particular column values using Jasper variable. You will also learn to sort particular column values. You will learn how to have this kind of page footer where you can display current page out of total number of pages. Charts are very useful to summarize your data in the report. So in this course, you will learn how to have this kind of pie chart and 3D bar chart in your report. In this course, you will learn to export this kind of report in different formats like PDF, HTML and Microsoft Excel. You will learn to create this kind of report from your Java and Spring Boot application. So what are you waiting for? Link for the course is given in the description. Just click on that link and start creating reports from your Java and Spring Boot application. We'll see you in the another video. Till then, happy learning and happy coding.